Hello everyone, this is Doug Zetteros. We are back for more Pokemon Uranium Nuzlocke. This is the redo. Oh, and well, I've decided to take the plunge. You hear the bath that I've used this variety of Pokemon can be found in caves, rock around and poison. If you've got water or fighting type, it's sure to come in handy for this battle. Here, take this. One fresh water. Good luck out there. I'm rooting for you. Okay, so... Wow, I've got one really viable contender. Everyone else is probably going to drop like a rock. Let's do this. <laughs> this is somewhere between brilliant and amazing. Don't me. Uh, you are poison flying. So the big thing going on here is I just need to handle this. Alright, that was a critical hit that only did 8 damage. And it's now paralyzed thanks to Static Touch. Alright, I dropped it. Alright, another Tonami. Nope. We're going full in, all out. Smog, chance of poison. Good chance of poison, actually. Hmm. Yeah, I should tweak those settings a little. That way, and I don't have Thundershock all the way at the end. It's closer to the start. That just gives me easier access to it, frankly. Do I have... Ah, oh, poisoned! I'm definitely going to want to run out and heal after this fight. There we go. Ah, just short of love lane. Wait, Pokemon Smash? I need Rock Smash. Do I have a Pokemon that can learn it? I don't have a whole ton of Mon now. There were deaths. Death works against the Nuzlocke, which can actually render it unwinnable. Uh, let's see where your moves. Oh, I want Tail Whip in the last slot. There we go. Bag. Uh smash Will you teach a mon? Yes I will. It is time for Rock Smash Alright, goodbye tackle and hello Rock Smash That just Made St. Elmo more... Yeah, I'm leaning on St. Elmo really heavily. <laughs> it should... Sort of should do... Uh, it's not a brilliant idea. Right, Jim. I remember those are useful. So I probably just need to do a lot of rock smash... Gotta break things. Well, I found one useful thing. And Smashing Rocks always has a chance that, you know, you'll encounter something. And most of the things I will encounter, St. Elmo is going to be good against. The elect... Ooh, yeah, the electric does pose some risk. Hmm. Yeah, but... That's a risk I just have to accept and take. Oh, wow. That one shot the Grozard. Yes, St. Elmo grows. Nope, St. Elmo's red in this. This little baby's taking me to the championship. Yeah, if I can hit 20 and possibly evolve St. Elmo, then we got something. 
Uh, hold on. His Pokemon are no joke. Wait. Is that gem what I needed? Do I get it that quick? This is only like the second gym, so... I still want to like explore and see what's around here. I probably already got the thing I need. Uh, I am curious. Yep. That was what I needed. Alright. Been digging tunnels for years. Uh, barrel. Aqua Jet. Two Aqua Jets. An Aqua Jet and a Rock Smash. Aqua Jet Rock Smash. Rock Smash. Yeah, I'd mainly love to push Elmo up another level. I don't think I'm gonna get that though. Not without genuinely grinding. I'd love St. Elmo to be 20. Well. Huh. Oh wow, that just about killed him. Two shots. Boom. Those have a decided chance of being two shots. Just thanks to the fact that, uh, those things can have Sturdy, and that's got the modern interpretation of Sturdy, not the Dem Pearl, which strictly protected against one-hit KO moves. Then Sturdy got rewritten, uh, like, see, Dem Pearl Platinum. Might have been around Platinum. <sighs> or when we moved into the Black and White era, Wherein it became sturdy protected you from being KO'd in a single shot. Alright. This is more for my own, own uh, peace of mind. I'm still running a computer program that was made by, you know, fans. I've been through this once before, but it always pays to do a safety save to make sure that the game can't crash on you and cost you everything. All right, Leader Darvin sends in a Grozard. All right, it's only a level stronger than the ones I was fighting, which means Aqua Jet has a great chance of just going boom. I don't want that getting off a shot. That's a ground type, which means it might have Earthquake. Most of these can have Earthquake. Uh, yeah. Aqua Jet's pretty much my go-to. If I had a choice item, I would slap it on St. Elmo immediately. But, I don't. Oh, Potion. Only restores 20 HP. I'm doing more than 20 HP, so this Modril should be dropping. 20. 19. Almost there. No. I'm not chancing anything. Oh, wow. That's the evolution of Barrel. Alright. It is going to be a two shot. Maybe three with that Harden. It's only gone up a little. A half step. Just enough. Headbutt. 46. Alright, that was nine points of damage. Heal for 20. Yeah, the only way you're getting through that was would be healing till I ran out of uh, that PP. Not likely. Toflerang, that's the evolution of Tonami. So weird, it goes from, you know, this little flying bat to this big, like, hippo thing with a bat-like appearance. Okay. This is the last one. Uh, no, stay with Aqua Jet, because I don't know it's Typing. Poison Fang. And I'm poisoned. Badly poisoned. Did that 
That changes my song fast. All right. 25 to 16. I'm still taking nine per. I'll expend a precious super potion. Heal all the way. Yeah, I'm just eating damage at this rate. All right. I have to watch my health like a hawk here. All right. Tackle. All right. Took six that go. All right. All right. I got hit by intimidate. I have to keep that in mind. Yes. Statics fired off. All right. Yeah, no real difference in terms of damage. Well, I got plenty of these. Yeah, none of this stuff was doing excess. Yeah, you know, six damage, but I'm in very critical health. Even if the game isn't saying it, I know I am. Oh, wow. I've got less healing items than I thought. Oh, for frack's sake. Yeah, I know I'm eating hits because of this, and I'm getting poisoned infinitely more than I should be. Okay, well, I'm safe enough. Aqua Jet. Twenty-five. Okay, I'm on the cusp of where I need to heal. Just some straight damage. Ooh, that that did some chunky damage. All right, step one, heal so I can take the coming hit. Yeah. Yeah, this poison is the deadly poison. The stuff I really don't want to be dealing with. I had to do that to reset the poison. Wow, I was right to say reset the poison. Holy crap. All right, Aqua Jet. This should do it. Yes, he didn't heal. St. Elmo wins. Victory for Rose! <laughs> that was a well-earned victory. Hey, you're more than deserving of the Bright Gem Badge. Got 1600 for winning. Awesome! Well, fuck, kid, consider me impressed. Uh, let's see, now if you could hand over that gem you found earlier. Ta-da! Here's your badge. So the gem I got to solve the puzzle here... Game my badge. TM, Brick Break. Ooh, that's useful. Brick Break is a fighting type move which will actually break, reflect, and light screen. These moves cut in half the, uh, the impacts that moves have. Reflect works against physical attacks and light screen works against special attacks. Uh, let's see. This is only the second. Oh, wow. Yeah, I know. I'm poisoned. But I don't have to worry. Because this isn't... a uh, game where... Uh, you can die from poisoning just running around. That was like Gen 1. Please, no events. Please, no events. Yes, no events. Yeah, St. Elmo still needs to get healed. Okay. Well. All right. Shorter go today, but we took down a gym. I certainly hope you enjoyed it. I'm going to have a lot of fun editing that just because I need I'll need to turn on the poison effect on and off on and off. Uh, well, future me, this is all for you and everyone else. Thank you for watching. Please be sure to like, comment, subscribe, ring the bell for notifications so you know when videos come out. We are 
very much aiming for our Monday through Friday release schedule. Plenty of Pokemon and Skyrim and a bit of Zelda for you. Anyway, take care and we'll see you next time.